hear a telephone conversation between an employee at a pet insurance company and a customer. You have 30 seconds to look at questions 1 to 6. Pet Protect UK, how can I help? Oh, hello there. I'm calling to inquire about your pet insurance plans. Of course. Just give me a second, please. Sure. So, have you checked our website already to see the options we offer? I've had a quick glance, and I think I'm interested in the basic plan. Great. I need to just ask a few questions first, then. Is your pet a dog, a cat, or a rabbit? It's a dog. And is it a puppy or...? No, he's three years old. Right. May I ask, has your dog been insured before? I just adopted him from the rescue centre last week, and I think he'd been there a while, so I doubt it. OK, so you've had him for a week then? That's correct. Great. I apologise for asking this, but your dog... What's his name, by the way? Fenton. Fenton. Is that spelt with an F? Yeah. F-E-N-T-O-N. -N. Great. Thank you for that. So, according to the Rescue Centre, has Fenton ever attacked, bitten, or been aggressive towards a person or another animal? No, not at all. Excellent. And is he a guide dog, or...? No, just a house pet. Great. And you said he's three years old. Do you know the exact date of birth? Oh, yes. It's on the adoption certificate. Just give me a sec. Um... It's May 19th, 2013. And do you know, has Fenton been neutered? Yes, he's been castrated. Excellent. And final question. What type of dog is Fenton? Is he a pedigree, a crossbreed, or a mixed breed? A uh, crossbreed, I think. Right. A uh, crossbreed... Wait, sorry. What's the difference between the three? A pedigree is a dog whose parents are of the same breed... A crossbreed is from two different breeds, while a mixed breed is three or more. Then he's a mixed breed. Sorry about that. Right, no worries. So, could I take your full name, please? My name is Peter Pishinger. That's P-I-S-C-H-I-N-G-E-R. Right, thank you for that. And what's your address? That's 27 Cherry Drive, NW8 3HD. 3 H.D. And finally, a telephone number, please. 020-3634-7957. Thank you. You now have 30 seconds to look at questions 7 to 10. Now, you said you were interested in the basic plan. Is that correct? Yes, that's correct. May I ask, are you planning to switch insurance providers after the first year of your pet insurance, or is there a possibility you might renew with us? I haven't really thought about it. Why? The reason I'm asking is because if you plan to renew with us, it might be worth considering our premium or ultimate premium plan. With the basic plan, you will have to pay the same fee of £8 per month regardless of how long you stay with us. If you choose one of our other two plans, though, you will receive a discount for the first six months. You'll only have to pay £12 for premium and £15 for ultimate. And then, depending on your circumstances, you might be eligible for further discounts after your first year, depending on how many expenses you claim. 
If you claim less than £300, you'll have to pay the same as for the basic plan, but receive the cover provided by the premium plan. Huh. Is that something you might be interested in? I'll have to think about it. Is it possible to switch to one of the other plans later on? Yes, of course. You can always upgrade. Let's stick to the basic plan for now then, and then I might call you back to switch. No problem. So, what happens now? Well, first we would need you to come over with Little Fenton so we can have a look at his documents and medical history. We'd also need you to get him to the vet for a quick checkup. All of this is standard procedure before we can proceed with the insurance plan. And then, when all that's done, you can either set up a direct debit in person or you can call us back and do it over the phone. Right. And the basic plan will cover... Well, the basic plan covers veterinary fees, obviously, plus a few more things such as boarding costs, loss by theft or straying, advertising and reward, death by accident or illness. You can find a comprehensive list on our website, or I could forward it to you via email if you prefer. Thanks. I'll check the website. No problem. So, shall we book you an appointment so you can come over? That is the end of part one. You now have half a minute to check your answers. Hi, this is Old Spob. I would very much appreciate it if you could like, subscribe and share this video, as this will enable me to help more old students reach their old goals. Very much appreciate it. Thank you.